Hi, it's Andy again, and I have another tutorial. Today, I'm going to talk to you about the snack bar. Um, basically, it, snack bar is a lot like um, the toast, except you can add a button and um, have that button have its own action and do something else. So, um, it, there really isn't very much different difference from the toast, other than it's got a little neat design. Uh, but it's pretty simple to implement because it's a lot like toast. So in this tutorial uh, I'm going to use this floating action button here uh, Basically the exact same one that we used in the in the last tutorial on floating action button change the icon a little bit and show you uh, a Snack bar that's going to pop up. So for the snack bar fragment um, Like we, like before we're just going to use our floating action button use it as a an actual button and then um, you just do snack. You call snack bar dot make. Um, call the view that is that is actually initiating it. So just V here. Um, we're just going to display the text called "This is a snack bar." Um, like toast, you need to specify how long you want it to show. So this one we're just going to do long, and then and last thing is show, which actually inflates the the view. Um, so let's run this in our emulator and see what it looks like. So let's pull this out. Let's go to the snack bar. There you go. So this is a snack bar. It's exactly like a toast except if we wanted to we can actually put a little button here in the um, bottom right corner. As you can see though there is a little side effect that we don't actually really particularly want. Uh, the snack bar is covering up our our fad button. Um, there's a solution to that and that it's kind of what the whole purpose of coordinator uh, layouts are. So I will actually have in the, the last tutorial in this series is this coordinator fragment tutorial. Um, we're going to fix a lot of the, the, the issues here. We're going to have the snack bar uh, display, but move the fab button up. Um, I'll probably put in a recycler view with some other stuff up here uh, to kind of show you how this all works. And uh, I'll, for for fun, we'll put in a little button here that's going to do something else to like undo or whatever. Um, all right, so um, hope you like this tutorial and uh, keep watching because there's a lot more to come. Thank you.